As kids get ready to head back to school, doctors want to make sure parents understand the necessary precautions needed in the classroom. Our Brett Vickery spoke with a doctor today and shares information to alleviate some fears. To mask or not to mask, to vaccinate or not vaccinate. That's just a few of the questions parents have involving their children, especially as the school year is about to start. We spoke with UW Health Chair of Pediatrics, Dr. Ellen Wald, about some myths related to coronavirus. Myth number one, kids don't get seriously sick from COVID-19. Wald says that while it is true that children get sick less often than adults and have milder cases of COVID, that doesn't mean they can't turn severe. Children can get seriously ill and that 340 children have died this year from COVID and that 4,000 of them have had a serious complication. Myth number two, masks are not safe and kids refuse to wear them. The kids are adaptable and they're resilient. And, you know, even children under five do really well. They are super effective and they're absolutely safe. People have made up truly a myth that they're not safe. And there's just no factual content behind that. Myth number three, the vaccine currently approved for kids 12 and up was rushed. Wald says vaccine doses are primarily based on weight, not just age. Many 12 year olds are 100 pounds and many smaller women are 100 pounds. And we know that the vaccine was totally safe in that weight group, even though they were older. So I think people felt comfortable with the idea that we could use the same dose. And then they tested the same dose and they were able to see that it was safe. Dr. Wald says that scientists hope a vaccine dose will be approved for kids ages 5 to 11 by the end of this year. Reporting in Milwaukee, Brett Vickery, Fox 6 News.